In this circuit, I'm going to use a capacitor to light up an LED. Um, so this circuit is going to, you know, it demonstrates the workings of a capacitor and how it can momentarily um, light, uh, keep an output on for a period of time, even if the main power supply shuts off. So in this circuit, I'll just quickly go over the setup. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, so I have a push button. This is a normally open push button. So when I press it down, it's closed. So right now it's open, so no power is going to the capacitor or LED. And then to this push button, I have a capacitor in parallel. This one specifically is a, a thousand microfarad capacitor. I'm going to do a few to demonstrate how um, different capacitances can keep an output device on for a longer or shorter period of time. And I have a 470 ohm resistor just to limit current to the LED and I have an LED which in this case is our output device. So <clears throat> when I turn on the when I press down on the push button <coughs> excuse me, the LED and the capac the capacitor will charge up and the LED will turn on. And then after I um that's for as long as I'm holding it down and then once I release it the LED will stand for a period of time longer because the capacitor then acts as a temporary power source for the LED. The bigger the capacitance, the longer it can keep an output device on. So to demonstrate, right now I'm using 9 volts from a DC power supply for the circuit. So once I push down, see it stays on. Now if I let go, you'll see the LED stayed on for a period longer even after after I let go. So again, lights up. I let go. LED still stayed on. This is a thousand microfarad capacitor, so now I'm going to use I want to demonstrate a 3300 microfarad um, capacitor. So I'm going to just take out this so I'm going to remove this 1000 microfarad capacitor and put this 3300 microfarad capacitor. Okay, I think that's, hold on. Yeah, I think that's in. Okay. So now I'm going to put on back the power supply and the connections are good. Okay, so now I'm going to press down again. Now I'm going to let go. As you can see, it stayed on for a much longer period of time. This is because we're using now almost more than three times the capacitance we were using before. So this is, again, a 3,300 microfarad capacitor. So let go stays on so I'm gonna up it again I'm gonna change out this um, capacitor for now I'm using a 4700 um, microfarad capacitor Okay, I think that's in. Let me just make sure all the connections are good. Yeah, I believe that's good. So, okay, so if I press down the push button again, and then I let go, you can see it stayed on for a much longer period of time again so this just um, goes to show you that <clears throat> the larger a capacitor is the more charge it can store and the longer it can um, the, the more current it can provide to keep an output device on longer so 
This is just a circuit to demonstrate how a capacitor can act as a temporary power supply and how it acts as a charge reservoir um, so that it can power an output device.